Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some Warzone. And guys, now I have a settings video for you guys. I have a secret settings that will enhance your gameplay and make you much better and easier and just like make you play better, I guess, with your movement and stuff because it really does help and it gives you a competitive advantage. So basically, you can do this uh, with your controllers on your console and on PC if you have a customizable controller. So what you're gonna do is okay so the main problem is you can't jump and crouch and prone and slide you know those two things without taking your hands of the joysticks if you play on a standard controller without claw um so we're going to be fixing that you can use bumper jumper tactical but the problem with that is it is actually super hard to learn so if you do end up learning that good for you but if you can't which i personally couldn't here's a cheat and a easier way around it so what we're going to do i'm going to show you a video of this what we're going to do is we're gonna go on our console settings and we're gonna swap the function of the X button uh, which is the jump button in my PS4 um, case in, on, on Xbox will be something different so we're gonna change that jump uh, button which is X with the left joystick so we're gonna change our functions this will be changed for that entire account you did that on on the PlayStation even selecting your game or whatever like it's gonna change but it's actually pretty easy to get used to i won't worry too much about it and of course it will give you that major competitive advantage so yeah you're gonna be swapping their functions i will show you a video of it guys again um yeah so basically you can then jump with your left joystick and obviously make sure you're using a tactical setting of whatever uh, that way you can also crouch prone and uh, prone and uh, slide with your right joystick which allows you to have ultra speed like better speed than anyone who's not doing that yeah so that's i'm going to show you in the video and then after that i'll scroll through my normal settings just so you guys have an idea of what i play on yeah so that's gonna be the video if you guys do find this setting helpful which i'm about to show right now make sure you guys smash the like button and if you are new subscribe because i will be um showing making a lot more a uh, lot more warzone videos like this one and hopefully they'll be you find them just as helpful yeah so yeah let's get into the video Okay guys, I'm on my mobile device now and I'm going to show you basically the monitor and what I'm doing. So on the PS4 at least, you go to your settings as you guys can see over here. And you go to your accessibility. Then you can see over here you're going to have button assignments. Obviously you want to enable custom button assignments. Then you go to custom button assignments and you basically just want to switch the X or whatever your jump button is with the left joystick. As you guys can see that's what I've done and then that's that's literally all you got to do all you got to do and then all the functions of them will be changed so even selecting stuff as i said before guys all that's gonna be changed but again you get that huge competitive advantage okay guys now i'm gonna basically just go over and like just scroll over my settings to show you guys quickly what i use so you guys have an idea i use bumper pink tactical some people use dynamic i don't D dead zone is like depending on your controller i use high seven it gets a bit lower than default standard standard contextual tab the best um have this enabled tap for slide obviously um you can really have this on i just choose not to this is the best you should have automatic tactical sprint on all times yeah okay so that's for general i think this is just default turn this down all the way Letronopia makes the colors pop more Disable, disable, 100%. Square, I I like it with the rotation. Letters are better for me. I use boost low. Lower this so it's not like overtaking and distracting. Lower this because it is important, but like I don't want to distract again. Yeah, those are the settings basically I use guys. Um, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below and I'll answer them. But yeah, that's uh, going to be it for this video, guys. Make sure you guys smash that like button if you guys enjoyed it or thought it was helpful. More videos just like this one coming, so make sure you guys subscribe.